Veterinarian offices are receiving calls about a few pests causing problems for pets. New at 6, Fox News' Patrick Clark talks with the vet about what you should consider with cicadas and ticks right now. Sorry to be the bearer of bug news, but veterinarians are dealing with two tiny issues currently. One of them is dogs sick from consuming cicadas. Cicadas, we are getting a lot of calls about it. Um, so a lot of dogs like the taste of them. I've heard they taste like peanut butter, so makes sense. Um, eating one or two is fine. Um, some dogs are really sensitive, so they may get some GI upset. When we eat a bunch of them, we are seeing dogs vomiting, having some diarrhea, maybe with some blood, and then they might need to be seen by a vet. Cicadas like these, heard in the outdoors near you, are harmless to humans and even good for yards and gardens. But for dogs with sensitive stomachs, they can cause some gastrointestinal issues if large quantities are ingested. At Clark Animal Hospital in Kirkwood, they're celebrating their new location with an open house on Saturday, June 8th from 1 to 3. But Friday afternoon, the phone calls beside cicada questions, the other topic, ticks. So unfortunately, in Missouri, we have ticks and they seem to be getting worse every year. Um, Last week, I had a patient that had 30 ticks on them. Um, so they're definitely out there. That was on a trail in, in St. Louis County, so we know they're there. Um, we are seeing a lot of dogs. We test for a few tick-borne diseases, just screening tests, and we do have quite a few in Missouri that pop up for Ehrlichia, um, which is a disease that may cause no problems, but some dogs do get really sick with, um, carried by our ticks. And then we are seeing Lyme showing up, keeping your animals on flea and tick prevention 24 seven year round here in Missouri. Unfortunately, we don't get the freezes like we used to get um, to kill them all off in the winter. Um, most of the time we see tick borne disease now is in the winter because people have taken their pets off of it for the colder months. In Kirkwood, Patrick Clark, Fox 2 News.